guys welcome back to my channel so today I'm gonna do an at-home workout for you guys specifically on lower body workouts so I'm only going to be using these bands because I have them but they're completely not necessary for this workout if you absolutely have no equipment you could do this on a floor in an open space anywhere um, I did actually just go ahead and purchase the longer bands with the handles um, I feel like having those on hand will be great for at-home workouts to do a little bit more complex movement so if you are interested in making your workouts a little bit more difficult I suggest buying these I got these off of Amazon and then of course the longer bands with the handles I will be putting out some videos as soon as I get those in the mail they were actually supposed to come today but I just figured I would do a workout with only using these or nothing at all so stay tuned for the video I'm gonna do a voiceover with it and then everyone's been asking me for a life so I'll probably include that over the workout footage as well so this workout's gonna be a circuit workout uh, each exercise I'm gonna do for about 30 seconds and then I'm gonna switch to another exercise in a whole circuit and I'm gonna repeat the circuit about three times and I have a total of three circuits so that's how I'm gonna do this workout so I hope you guys enjoy it and I will get started so I figured I would just do a life update over this workout footage because one the workout footage is pretty self-explanatory and two a lot of people have been asking me for a life update and I think that's so sweet that someone out there cares to know what's going on or how medical school is going and so I did just finish my first year of medical school um, for any of new subscribers I am in medical school right now I'm getting my MD so I am one-fourth done with the schooling process I am in an international program so I am out of the country for two years and then my last two years I am in the States um, and I will be at a hospital and I don't know what state I want to go to but you kind of get to rank your top three choices that's not residency yet um, it's just clinical work in hospitals and I'm thinking either Chicago or the New York area because I am in the New York area right now and I'm really liking it the first year is done and it went so well and I would say first semester the biggest challenge was you know being in a different country being away from your family knowing that you couldn't just go home if you wanted to that was probably my my biggest challenge and then of course the first couple weeks is always figuring out how you're going to study all the material at once um i am lucky where i didn't have any like gap years so i went from i graduated undergrad and then the following August, I started school after a summer off. And the summer I did my bikini prep. Now when I did my bikini prep, I didn't know that I was going to go to medical school um, that following August, cause I actually was getting a lot of no's from a lot of medical schools. And uh, so I was like, you know what, I'm gonna do my bikini prep, focus on my YouTube videos. And cause I gotta do something when I graduate. I can't just do nothing. So um, <laughs> looking back on it, would I have dieted all summer before I realized I was going to be out of America? Probably not, but the bikini prep was really fun and it, it had good content for YouTube. But so I would say the first challenge was just like being out of America and figuring out, you know, how to get around and getting everything together while getting good grades. And then second semester, uh, the coursework got a lot harder for about, I would say, Half the year, the last half the year was straight neuro, neuroscience, and um, I'm not particularly a fan of neuroscience. It's very difficult. I have done basics of, of medicine, like fundamentals, that was like the first eight weeks. Cardio, um, respiratory, renal, I have done endocrine, I have done neuro, I have done GI. So I've done, I've basically, the first year of medical school they always say is like, you learn everything that's supposed to happen that goes right in someone's body and then all next year, which is going to be my second year of medical school, you learn of everything that goes wrong. So it's going to be really interesting. I'm pretty excited for next semester, uh, next year in general. But so medical school has been going great. So I am on the East Coast right now and it is pretty fun to be out here because it is my summer break. I am staying with my significant other, which if you follow me on Snapchat or Instagram, 
then you probably know that already. <laughs> I am trying to work on my fitness as best as I can while I'm at school, but it's really fun to YouTube and do all this again and be on Instagram and social media when I'm on summer break because it is really fun for me. I've always said that YouTubing was one of, is, is my favorite hobby and it really is. Oh. This definitely isn't my, my job or I don't want to be technically like a social media influencer when I grow up. I'm totally science sciencey I love medical school I want to be a doctor I want to be a surgeon I'm gonna keep trucking away at that that's my number one priority but youtubing is definitely something that's super fun for me so that's what I'm kind of doing right now I feel like my life update isn't really anything crazy but if you want to know more about my personal life you can always follow me on snapchat and Instagram okay just finished the workout and I'm sweating so I hope you guys enjoyed that workout. Oh my God, I'm like dripping. And I will see you guys in the next video. Don't forget to subscribe and like the video.